Here's a really great tip that you can use in Canva. It's called copy to clipboard. Let's imagine that you've created a design. So let's create something like this, very simple, maybe like a logo or a message. So let's do you are and beautiful. So this is gonna be a message or a t-shirt. And let's tweak it a little bit, get nice and big. And then we'll make this one a script font here and we'll resize this. So here we go, we've got our message. And now normally you would download this with a PNG background, transparent background, and then upload it into your design. But let's say that you were just doing something quick for a client or you wanted to see what this mock-up might look like on a t-shirt. You don't have to export this design. In fact, you can go over to share and click on more and then we're going to go to copy to clipboard so what this is going to do is just copy it to your clipboard so that you could paste it somewhere else into your design so it'll take a few seconds and then now it says copied to clipboard so we'll create a new artboard and we'll paste that and let's resize and now let's say we want to know what this is going to look like on a t-shirt so we'll go to edit image and we'll scroll down to the different mock-ups that we have here. See all. And let's see what it might look like on a hoodie. There we go. And then we'll click apply. We will set the image as a background. And there you go. So if you're doing something for a client in Canva or you just want to see what your own designs might look like when it's mocked up on a T-shirt, then you can do that. You could do the same thing with mugs, business cards. It's a great way to save time without having to waste time downloading and then re-uploading it right back into Canva. So I hope that this helped you. If you like Canva tips like this, be sure to subscribe and follow along for more coming your way. Now it's time for you to go create something amazing. I'll see you next time.